yes welcome back students in my previous video i've explained you the concept of marconic of addition and anti marconic of addition so what should i remember if it is symmetrical not a problem there is direct addition around the double bond if it is marconic of addition it should uh, the condition is and for unsymmetric it applies uh, for the unsymmetrical alkenes so in that the negative part adds to the carbon around the double bond which has less number of hydrogens in anti marconic of addition i have to remember the negative part adds to the carbon having more number of hydrogens remember that let us solve these so now if this particular equation is given to me complete the following and propene to one bromo propane so it's a basic conversion which i have explained we'll be doing more number of conversions yes so propene <coughs> now one two this is a propene they have not mentioned so one propene it's understood so let us write ch3 1 2 3 h and ch2 now what should i get, uh, convert it to one bromo propane so just put an arrow and write this compound again so because reactant and products are given to me let me write 1 2 3 yes one bromo one bromo propane ch3 ch2 ch2 i have to prepare this now what are you finding what is the difference here there is a double bond there is no double bond here that means addition reaction has happened you are going to break or you are going to cleave this double bond and add what are you finding you are going to add one hydrogen here one br basically this is our double bond which has cleaved yes just observe and formed this product so what should you add you have to add one h br to this simple right so what happened now this is going to come and add here ch2 this is going to come and add here ch3 so ch3 ch3 ch2 this h has added here ch2 ch2 is here and your br is here yes which rule did it follow first of all it is unsymmetrical alkene which rule did it follow hbr we are adding in a reverse order they have not mentioned any peroxide in anything but it it has added h and br so what is followed here what should also be there in the reaction just see unsymmetrical in the uh, order of in the reverse order there should be a peroxide here for preparing that is how you get the product now let us write this now observe carefully this one compound given to us now bond line structure this is called bond line structures now if it carbon is not mentioned it is understood here there is one carbon here one carbon here okay fine yes now first of all i have to see whether it is symmetrical or unsymmetrical now le let us see how is it placed now this is your double bond this carbon h and h done now this is your carbon there is one benzene ring here one hydrogen here done now according to the rule this is plus this is minus now just see the negative part adds to the carbon having less number of hydrogens okay fine so now according to this when this particular bond bulkier group so your negative goes here and your h comes here how do you get one benzene ring yes this is done this and this and now you're going to just write carbon your so let me write single your h and your br both here and this particular thing your h so let me be clear let me write above and below so that it is easy one bond here one bond here one bond here 1 2 3 4 now to this particular carbon h here one more h here one more h here yes the addition around the double bond yes it's going to undergo follow anti uh, it's going to follow marconic of addition that's the reason it has added the negative part to the reverse order let me see this reaction here they've given me specifically peroxide careful if peroxide is given to me i have to remember it the negative adds and uh, the negative part adds to the carbon having more number of hydrogens remember that so your br comes and adds here h comes comes in adds here so let me write ch3 ch2 ch h so what happened to this h yes it has added to this single bond ch2 br so negative part adds to the carbon having more number of hydrogen so this is called anti marconic of addition 
and and uh, this is also anti markovnikov addition this is your markovnikov addition markovnikov's addition so we are using the uh, mechanism i have given you listed out i have listed out certain examples please copy it and observe carefully your concentration should be around the double bond remember that and thank you for watching